All right, Dad Jack's Cold Water Blues here. So I told uh, Lakeisha's mom, Juanita, I was going to bring her some uh, chili, but I didn't have a whole lot of chili left. So I want to make some uh, some breakfast tacos. So that's what we did here. Come on in and look at this. See, I have my, uh, I have my, it's kind of like a bean soup now I turn my black beans into. So I just reduced it down. Because in the tacos, I don't want it. I don't want it to be too wet. So, uh, but anyway, so I have a pan on low heat for the tortillas, and you know we're just gonna use a little bit of butter. I mean, uh, bacon grease on the bottom, just so as you see, it's very little. Just to you know, get those tortillas. We want too much grease on those tortillas. And uh, I love these. We get them at uh, Fiddleheads. Maria and Ricardo's. They're a soft blend of corn and, and uh, whole wheat. I love them. But again, you know, they just don't eat, you know, in moderation. So, uh, let's put them down both sides. Okay, and we're going to slow cook them, and then I'm going to put uh, a little bit of American cheese, just, you know, so we can seal the edges. That's kind of what I'm looking for. Okay. So I guess two pieces of cheese. Um, so I'm gonna scramble some eggs. Again, just a little bit of, of bacon grease. I save it off. I mean, you can use butter. You gotta cook your eggs in something. So we're gonna do a little bit of jalapeno. And we grew out of our garden. A little bit of red pepper, it's not hot, it's kind of sweet, that Harley gave us. And then a little bit of uh, poblano. So we're just going to cut a piece off our poblano. It is a little, got a little heat to it. And then, uh, okay. That going real good. I got a little bit of leftover potatoes from a roast chicken we did the other night. That uh, stir would have, I don't try to, don't hit the bottom of your skillet with that metal. And then uh, we're gonna crack a little couple of eggs. Ooh, that didn't look all so good. Okay, I got a lot of, lot of um, you know, some salt in the bacon, salt in our our cheese, and uh, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put any kind of uh, uh, salt into my eggs. So then, uh, right in the center. Okay. And, uh, Let these potatoes brown up real good and we'll be right back. Alrighty, right. So, scrambled egg time. This should have mixed real good. A 
I just want to give them a quick. So we're just gonna just gonna put a little bit, just a little bit in there, cause we're gonna make a few more, cause we're gonna eat a couple and we're gonna bring a few to Juanita and Russell. I'll tell you what, you cook this for for pennies. No. Beautiful little breakfast. You'll get them some nice salsa. We try to get some of that Herdez at the store. All right, here we go. Southwest Tex-Mex breakfast tacos. Oh yeah. We got this one here back up. Pull that one over. That's it. How do they look, Lakeisha? They look delicious, honey. A little side of guacamole salad, a little lettuce and tomato guacamole salad. That's it. Black bean, egg, potato tacos. <clears throat> a little spice, a little jalapeno. All right, we'll be right back. All right, time to eat. While well, Axel's not here, look at these beautiful. Oh. And you, you know, you can, man, there was somebody, uh, my guys down in Texas, you know, they'd, they'd make these at home or workers, their wives, or they'd make them themselves. They put them up even at room temperature. They're delicious. Mmm. Those homemade tacos, you know, you make a bunch of them and just microwave them up if you need to or just heat them up or eat them cold. Just good, good, simple eating, you know, for pennies. I mean, a tortilla, they don't cost much. A couple of eggs, the beans, and a little bit of cheese. And that's a beautiful thing. Bring that over here. Over here. Okay, sure you got one for you. We got two in the skillet for your mom and one more. Bring her a little bit of that chili. And uh, again, it's the gift of food. It's a beautiful thing, you know. I, um, my friend Darren came over the other night and brought me uh, all his stuffed, uh, stuffed shells, a pan of stuffed shells. We might have those for dinner tonight or even on our Sunday dinner tomorrow. He, you know, he's a, I say amateur cook, no. He's a home cook, and uh, it was his grandmother's recipe, and he started off at like eight or nine, you know, nine or ten o'clock in the morning making the sauce, uh, cooked the shells, the big, big, big shells. He's got his grandmother's recipe. He put it together, and uh, he had told me he was going to come and drop some by. Came over. He'd been working all day. So proud of these. And uh, shared them with us. He, he knocked on our door, what, about 6 o'clock? Mm-hmm, 6 o'clock. And uh, here. And it was like an early Christmas present. Mm -hmm. That was his. He does it yearly, you know, brings them around and makes a whole bunch and distributes them around. And, we, you know, we mm -hmm. felt so fortunate mm -hmm. 
to uh, to get to get a batch of them because you know it's a lot of work goes into mm -hmm. preparing things. But you know you you light up somebody's life by bringing them some food. Isn't that right? So anyway, this is Daddy Jack's coat with the blues. Lakeisha Lee on the camera. Uh, we're getting her done. Made us a cheap, uh, a delicious little breakfast. Uh, if you want to check us out on Patreon, p a t r e o n uh, dot com forward slash Cooking with the Blues, and uh, uh, it's, it's uh, become a member of Cooking with the Blues. And then for memorabilia, my blackened seasoning. Uh, T-shirts, hats. We're going to be doing aprons for the holidays uh, with, a, with a beautiful logo. It's uh, uh, daddyjacksnewlondon.com. And I uh, love you all. Happy holidays. We got a beautiful turkey today from Stop and Shop. 88 cents a pound. A beautiful, nice, everybody's getting smaller birds now because, of, you know, the COVID and all that's going on. But. $10 for a beautiful bird. We'll be eating off of that for all week. Peace.